I hate everyone equally. Don't come at me and call me sexist or racist or any of these things. I hate everyone. I don't care if you're black, white, straight, gay, man, and woman. I hate you anyway. You're standing there and they say, oh, I don't actually eat gluten. Not the same thing? No. Can you admit you're a monumental failure and there's not a vehicle owner if I can't drive? I might, have, on. I might have to admit that. Or this. <laughs> I, might I, admit, I admit I'm not I might have to admit that. When you put a shirt on, You do your little buttons up, because you don't want anyone to look at you. Ooh, ooh. You don't want to show your fucking little shitty ass flabby chest. And I don't want, I don't want you to like say, look, I made a mistake. I'm a bimbo doing those things because you know what? I don't think women should be discussed that way. Like he was saying that women make mistakes all the time, can't even drive cars, all this shit. What the fuck? I don't think, I don't think. Only a cat owning bitch would complain to the police about a fucking joke. Fine, you're upset you lost your cat. Fair enough. Yeah, the joke may have been a little bit, you know, risque. Who calls the police on a fucking joke? Cat owners. Cat owners are liberals. Cat owners believe in hate speech. Cat owners are Democrats. Cat owners are dickheads. These motherfuckers have got fucking liquid that tastes like tomatoes in a fancy ass package printed all nice, shipped from the other side of the world, from China to fucking the West. And I can sit there and, and then some motherfuckers are like, oh, oh, it's bad for me. Duh the fuck are, how are people surprised by this shit don't challenge me you're effectively challenging me to a fight now you're gonna you're saying I, I wouldn't cry you're challenging me to a fight you're saying i can't hurt you you're out of your fucking mind and because it's not gonna be like oh hurt them enough so they enjoy it no i'm just gonna straight hurt you i don't even have to fuck you forget the sex part that's a distraction my dick can stay in my pants i'll just start beating the shit out of you how about that we walk in the bedroom i start kicking your ass I find myself super funny. <laughs> I find myself super funny. I'm, I am super funny. I know women because I made a lot of money from women. Let me tell you something. I've been attacked plenty of times and I've talked about this in another video already, but they are absolutely feeble. Ah, ah. Even with a knife, ah. they're useless. They ain't ready for the big man slap. I got a big hand. I'll bust their jaw with the bottom of my hand and the top of their head will feel the sting from the fingers like the whole Boom! That That's not gliding at all. I see the effort. He's slowing down so you can keep up. No. <laughs> I'm just walking at a normal pace. I'm not even walking fast. Now he's trying to catch up. He's, he's, he's trying to speed it up. When's the last time I got lucky lucky? And he's like, don't do it. It's like, bruv, don't trust the big G. I'm going to go to the casino with this 70. I'm going to turn it into 100. Because we have like a few days. We've got to pay this bill. And he's like, don't do it. I was like, bro, it's a big brother. Relax. So I went to the casino and lost all the money. Because <laughs> <laughs> when I sit here as the richest person who's ever fucking wasted his time talking to your fucking dumb ass and tells you what to do, you don't fucking listen to me. Oh, well, take, you know, maybe he's wrong about you're broke. How can I be wrong when you're in the poor category and I'm in the rich category? I obviously know something you fucking don't, you arrogant dickhead. Breathe air. You don't need a vape. Have you ever seen anyone with a vape? Have you ever, have you ever sat in a room? So we go, wait, oh, let me just go. My vape's done charging. Load it up. I mean, I smoke cigars, but I know what the fuck I'm doing. Give me a big fat cigar. So printers are shit. Here's my new fucking... There's a traffic jam. No big deal. Whatever. Big Daddy Tate, I can handle it. Someone goes... There's a climate change activist and they blocked the road. What? There's climate change activism, extinction rebellion. Yeah, I'll show you an extinction. You're gonna leave the man you love, the man you were head over heels in love with. You're gonna leave him and find another man who you don't love, who's still gonna cheat on you because you're still a trash bitch. <laughs> I am hilarious. Right. Shut up and listen. Is that Make what they, a is wish that what they kid donated $1. <laughs> I've been in a wheelchair for 15 years, Aiden, and my friend just showed me your stream Aww. tonight. I just wanted to say thank you for making me get out of my wheelchair to turn your stream off. <laughs> You're a fucking asshole, bro. You're a fucking asshole. Bro. Nah. That's not even. You go to your job. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Hey man, bro, look, yeah, bro, you, you, when you held his hand, you need to do the inverse flip and then all of them running and getting on skateboards.
and then skateboarding around the floor <laughs> and pretending they're doing their pack. Geeks, bro. The brokeys and all the fucking losers on Instagram. Like, ooh, hope I can get a girlfriend. Me, all I have to do is say, okay, address to every single girl who's already DMing me first. And now, I literally don't even, I, I don't even know who they are. Look, I don't even know there. I, I was, I haven't even spoken to anyone. I haven't even said hello. So Tristan doesn't know that he's upset I took his hotel room from him and doesn't understand why, but the truth is, because we're here to see my movie. Top G. Top G. Top G the movie. Life's okay, and then the V12 comes. In. And it's like, well, that's so loud. I'm just like, you're broke. Shut up. Yeah, you're broke. Shut up. No one cares. It's loud. You're you, broke. You know, they're probably so broke because they keep complaining. Too busy complaining to get rich. If they had their own V12, they wouldn't hear mine. How many megabytes is each song? Oh, he's, I think he's saying we're mega rich. No, megabytes. Megabytes. Oh, megabytes. No, not bite. Like bite. No. What's the world round? Yes, it's a globe. Globe tart. All right, so how's it flat then? Prove to me it's flat. <laughs> Look outside. I, I see the curve. He knows he's shit. I do, I see the curve. This is why you're 20 pounds. I'm rich. And you want Snoop Trump? Did you make him think something? And people always go, hey, Tate. You look in such good shape, like, what's your meal plan? Meal plan? <laughs> it's this. <laughs> it's true. <laughs> I'm naturally powerful. Nice. What pisses me off most, you thick fucks. Beer break. I'm gonna be like, bang, oh, I've seen that before. Okay, boom, boom, duck and dive in, take one terrorist out, next get the AK, go Rambo, take out all of fucking Pakistan with a G. I don't play games. Traffic's going this way. The traffic stopped. Traffic, she comes out, instead of just turning right and going on her way, she comes and just crashes into this car. And I sat there and I thought, how are women allowed to drive? Little electric, my little plug. Ooh, let, me, let me get my little plug and plug it into my Tesla. Ooh, maybe I can get an erection one day. Bodybuilding is a beauty pageant where dudes try their best to put on muscle so other dudes can say, you're the best looking dude. It's gay.